Church opinion, monthly piety for a year. No, we'll take church. Well, do we need church opinion? No, we do not. We'll take the piety. The emperor died. Does that mean medium crown authority is gone? No, we still have medium crown authority. But we can't change our damn ambition. God, that's annoying. Kill Prince Roberto of England. Oh my goodness! Prince of England? No, don't kill him. 20 bucks? Now don't kill him. God damn it, one of our advisors is a heretic. Oops. No. 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 Yes. Okay. No. No. Oh, god damn it. Our spy master is a heretic. Well, we'll just have to get a different spy master. I mean, if you won't convert. Yes, your scheming is misdirected. That's right. Hey, we have an Italian. He's going an Italian is going to become king of England. That is awesome. He's ugly, but that's okay. Let's see if we can get the queen married again to someone of my dynasty. Oh, there's no one available. Okay, never mind. I don't care. Fine then. Oh, there's the Genoese army. So Genoa is not going to lose Capua to them. So Genoa actually has 11,000 dudes. I'm surprised. That can't just be the Holy Orders. It is the Holy Orders. Huh, well then how are they fighting? I'm not sure. I'm not sure how Genoa is actually using the Holy Orders to fight Tuscany, but they are. You see right here? Genoa. Not sure. Fairs are fun for all. We could get kind or stressed. Hmm. We could get shy or prestige. We could lose some gold. Lose stewardship. But you get general opinion. Cynical or depressed. I don't want to lose any more stewardship, really, so. Oh, we didn't get shy. Good. We gained some prestige. Probably gonna have to remarry you, dude, because your wife's gonna die. You're a falconer. Good for you. <laughs> I don't think that matters. Hey, we got ambitious. Good. Get these other ones, too. This guy's just giving out all sorts of... Well, Lustful's not not that good. But he's giving it all sorts of good traits. He gave out just, brave, ambitious, and he gave out diligent. Very nice. Very nice. Keep going. This is our grandson here. This is our heir. Our heir's heir. Who are we going to nominate for the Holy Roman Empire? King of Bohemia, Duke of Brunswick, Duke, 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 Duke. 
Count of Corsica, Doge of Pisa, Duke of Venice. Let's do the Duke of Venice. <laughs> Why not? And eh, we got some free technology. I wish we could lower crown authority. Oh, and that war is over. Genoa already won that war defending Capua. Now what? Now they're defending Toulouse. Toulouse is no longer part of France. Interesting. Yep, Genoa's going to help out against the Muslims. Still no luck on Venice itself, but uh, other than that... Hey, Sweden, get out of Treviso. Come on. I want you to win the war. I honestly want you to win the war. But will you get out of my, my territory, please? What's this? Austrian independence. A one-province miner is trying to get independent. <laughs> Good luck. Two thousand gold. Yeah, let's build a harbor. Toll booth, thank you. Harbor. Thank you. It's nice having three cities in there. It really is. All these will pay off. Just building up the uh, taxes that we can claim from all of our cities. And yeah, that was a comment from someone that I don't build enough in my cities. That's very true, because you can make a lot of money building in your cities. Uh, I do tend to build up uh, the castles quite frequently, but I, I guess I don't build up the cities. That's true. Let's see, my dearest friend, for your is terrible. Long survive in this miserable dungeon. Yeah, we'll ask him to uh, pardon the guy. Dear Duchess Ermena Gilda the First, criminals belong in prison. Yeah, you lollard bastard. He's craven. How's our grandkids doing? Nothing new. He's almost c gonna come of age. Hopefully he'll get patient before he comes of age. And hopefully he'll get Midas Touch. That would be fantastic. Polish Holy War for Bohemia. Whoa, Poland's trying to take Bohemia. Oh, they can do a holy war because Lollard. Oh my god, holy war is going to be against us. Oh my god. Oh, we finally got shy. Damn it. Well, we're going to die shy. That's fine. Damn it. All 
I'm wondering if we could go for independence. I mean, it looks like... No, they're actually going to beat Poland back. Interesting. All right, well, he got Fortune Builder instead of Midas Touch. So 13 uh, stewardship. That's, that's fine. I wish he would have gotten uh, patient, but you can't get everything. And he did not get converted by that guy who was tutoring him. And that's good. So the most illustrious Duchess of Magilda, the good burgers, blah, 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 blah. Bribe him. Oh, shit. Our grandson has typhus. Oh, it's gone. Damn, that was quick. The hell? Rebels? Oh, it's not our rebels. I don't care. But yeah, it looks like the Holy Roman Empire might lose all of these wars, including Austrian independence. Actually, with Poland, they might win. The, yeah, I think I think they're pretty much done with Poland. All right, our chaplain died. We need to get a better chaplain than 13. But he better... Look at all these Lollards. Nope. My religion. Oh, great. You consider Lollard my religion? It's not my religion. Catholic. Oh, that's right. He already has a title. Never mind. Catholic. Not that many Catholics left, are there? There you go. You hate your liege. Perfect. Oh, he's already a baron. Damn it. that many Catholics left in the world. Or at least not in uh, the Holy Roman Empire. That sucks. Hmm, probably can't get them to come. Nah, it's too many. Too many penalties. There you go. Negative 96. Yep. Nah, he'll come. 20 bucks. He'll come. Yeah. But he's not that good. What is he? 15. Oh well. It's better than what we had. Camp Fever. Has Camp Fever. Epidemic Typhus. Oh, okay. Camp Fever. Why is it called Camp Fever? I don't know. Crusade for Italy. His Holiness the Pope is worried about the state of souls in the Kingdom of Italy. What Kingdom of Italy? That's Queen of Sicily. What Kingdom of Italy? I guess everything that's within the de jure kingdom of Italy. So there's now a crusade against us. So we're at war with the Pope now. That's so weird. Oh my god, everyone's joining against it. Ooh, wow. Oh, 
stupid mayor. Now he's a heretic. Can't imprison him though. Let's get our grandson married to someone. Oh, he's a crusader. Really? I guess. Let's see. Who is out there? Princess of Sicily, but she's not a genius, even though she has some good traits. I kind of would like someone who could boost our intrigue a little bit. Thirteen and twelve. Let's look beyond that. Women, married, no, my religion doesn't matter. Yeah, there's just not that many. Not that many that have good intrigue and good stewardship, is what I meant to say. Someone young would be nice. Do I hear 16? 16, but she's only 11. Damn. Not that many women out there are good stewardship. Damn. 40 years old is a little old for me, because you won't have that many babies. Seven. She hates us. It doesn't matter what her opinion is, but twenty nine. But her intrigue sucks. But her diplomacy is good. Well, let's see. What does he have as far as traits? Diligent. Gregarious. Let's look for someone who's diligent and gregarious. If that's possible. Because that means they'll get along better and they'll probably have more kids. Eh, I can't be that picky. Ooh, diligent. 49. Ouch. 37... 43, yeah, but most likely if they're not anywhere near Catholic, then it won't work. 20, damn, 58 years old, though. 71 years old, holy shit. 30, that's not that bad. Gregarious. Uh, yeah, she's actually a good match. Yeah, her. 30, bingo. Marry me. Or marry my grandson. Grandson. Alright. Good. So this is some crazy shit going on. Croatia is in this holy war against us. So whoever wins this is going to get control over all of the kingdom of Italy which is all of this region, which includes a lot of our land. So I think what we need to do is go independent right now so that we can avoid being conquered by someone. You, sir? Wow, we can press a lot of claims. Nope, what we're going to do is go independent. And that means we are no longer... Uh, going to be conquered by any of this shit. We can assert some titles, but I'm not going to worry about titles right now. What we should do is join this crusade, but I guess we have to win our independence first, don't we? So let's raise our troops. 
Uh oh. That might have been bad. I forgot about all these people we're currently at war with. Get ourselves some mercs. There you go. Ah, oh, shit. They're going to be killed right away. God damn it. What a waste of money. I didn't know they would spawn in Venice. Slow down, please. Thank you. Alright, now what is going on? Why am I hostile towards Denmark? I mean, I thought I wouldn't be in this crusade anymore. We're not Lollard. We are totally not Lollard. We're still paying those mercs, are we? Yeah, get rid of them. We lost all of them already. Uh, we could hire more mercs, though. Let's do that. Okay, so this is a crappy situation. I'm not sure how this is going to work. I don't see us listed here. We're not listed in the in the attackers or the defenders. I'm not sure. get our mercs off of Venice. There we go. Yeah, Holy Roman Empire is coming for me, so we're going to go hide in Croatia. We're not at war with you, are we? I don't think so. Oh, we're hostile. But we shouldn't be. Oh well. What the Holy Roman Empire has Venice? What? Hopefully he'll just march right through and start attacking the Pope. Or attack Croatia's troops or something. Just leave me alone. Yeah, he's attacking Croatia. Alright, let's get those ships back. Hello? Alright, that's what I wanted to happen. So he's attacking Croatia, not us. Good. That means we might get our independence after all. Alright, so now we're back to winning. Now we essentially just have to hold on to our land, but we can also go on the offensive if we want. And I guess we will. 
no reason not to. In the meantime, I'm going to pour myself some more coffee. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, the crusade is over and Croatia took over all of Italy. Look at that! What the fucking shit is going on in this map? And that sucks for us, because now the Holy Roman Empire is going to focus all of his troops on me. He's still at war with uh, Norway, but that's... Damn. I can't believe that. Holy war for Italy. So now the next thing we have to do is swear fealty to Croatia. But we have to get peace first. That means we have to win our war against the Holy Roman Empire first. Man, this is so messed up. Alright, you lack a guardian. You are our kinsman. And you lack a guardian. You are... Oh. It's only you that lacks a guardian. Alright, let's get you a guardian. I'll do it. Uh, I've decided to institute high crown authority in the kingdom of Sicily. Oh. Oh, what? It's, oh, Italy. I'm sorry, Italy. So he's created the kingdom of Italy now that he's taken all these lands here. High crown authority. No. Go suck an egg. I imagine all these provinces will be pissed off with Croatia. And if that's the case, they will be uh, revolting against him. So that's going to be our opportunity to get some land in here is when they revolt against Croatia. But damn, what a weird situation there. So I guess uh, the Holy Roman Empire going Lollard has really really changed this game. We're going to go over here and hide a little bit. Alright, he's sieging. That's fine. I guess we can siege here. Wait, I don't want to fight him. Aw, oh, shit. We'll just siege over here for a while. Actually, he's losing a ton of troops there. Oh my goodness, look at that. Let's go attack him. Look at that. What a bad siege on his, idea on his part. He won the siege, but wow. I want to attack him while his morale is still low. He's running to Salzburg, but we're going to siege this stuff back first. Terminal stage leprosy, and who is this we can imprison? 100% chance of success. Why? She's plotting for something. She wants to kill some random courtier. Why would I care? Just... End your plot. I don't care. It doesn't matter. Heir to the kingdom of Bohemia. Just end your plot. Oh well.
So that was the Holy Roman Empire's main army down here. I think they have another big army up here. But that was kind of cool to see them siege foolishly like that. They won the siege, but man, at what cost? Alright, we have a prisoner. Let's go ransom him. 25 gold. Nice. Absolute crown authority in Italy. Ignore. I don't care. And imprison someone again. I'm going to get myself some coffee. He's plotting. We'll take a look at it in a second. I'm pouring coffee. Alright, what is it? Kill some courtier. To just... Oh. Yeah, cool. Ambitious. Nice. Now, before he turns 15, I mean 16, let's see if we can get him a guardian who can get him Midas touched or something. Sure. Our husband. He won't convert to Aquitaine within one year, so. So I have a feeling we're gonna get our independence here. That's that's really cool. What a weird set of circumstances. Our Chancellor, what happened? He left our... No, he's still in our court. Well, then, uh, go back to being Chancellor. And instead of claims on... Well, I guess we can keep going for Genoa. I don't know. I'd rather keep getting stuff in this area, though. Let's just go back to getting claims in this area. Wow. You have a lot... Of counties, you pr probably more than you should have. Uh oh, six thousand troops. Are you done with all your wars? Oh my God, <laughs> Duchess Ermenegilda the Old. <laughs> Goodness, Ferrara, Parma, Genoa. Some of these we're just not going to get. I don't think we can beat Genoa in a war, at least not while we're fighting for our independence. So. Uh, yeah, but 6,000 troops. Have you finished off these other wars that you're in? No, it looks like you haven't. You're in a holy war for Bohemia. You're in Austrian war for independence. And you're defending against Norway. And you're losing all these wars, so that's cool. Yeah, we, we are the old. There is nothing notice. There is nothing notable about us other than the fact that we are indeed old. All right, looks like this army down here is sieging. They just wasted a bunch of troops. They're wasting troops again. Here they come. If they want to do that a lot, that's fine by me. We'll just sweep in. All right, now that it looks like they're coming north, so we'll see. If they get close, we're just going to run away. Yep, they're sieging again.
because they're eventually going to hit a fort that they won't be able to siege. Like, it'll just have too many defenders, like over here in Stiermark. And, uh, they'll lose a lot of morale and shit. Alright, he got Midas touched. Good. He's just some random kinsman, but that's still good. Alright, let's see if we can get him... Uh, someone within our domain. Or not our domain, but someone within our... Our vassals would be nice to marry. Princess of Bohemia. Actually, that's... Yeah, that'll do. He's going to go fight uh, Poland now. That's good. Then we'll go back to Treviso and get this shit back. Because our war score is going to go up uh, dramatically if we can... Oh shit, he has another army down here. Our war score is going to go up dramatically if we can uh, hold on to our lands. That's how you get independence. You just hold on to your own lands. That's all you have to do. Yeah, he's walking away from us. Good. I know, we have vassal levies that we could raise, but I don't really want to. Nope, now he's coming our way again. Oh, we're ill. Now we're infirm. Ew. Alright, we now have too many things. Actually, let's go this way, shall we? So let's give away something to our son. Let's give him... I don't know. Modena. No, let's give him Crane. Yep, he's assaulting another fort. This sucks. This is the perfect time to get independence, obviously, so don't get conquered by Croatia. But, oh, what the hell? We don't have vassal levies raised. What are you talking about? Uh, fine. I don't want to fight rebels. Damn it. Let's go this way. We might just have to get a big army and just start slaughtering this this thing here cuz otherwise I don't know what to do. But that's going to be so expensive. Oh well. We'll deal with it. Man, that's a lot of gold. We're only going to be able to hold, hold on to it for like half a year. But if we can beat that army with it, that's fine.
7th, September, August. Then we'll wait a few days. There we go, 7th September. All right. Holy crap, we captured a lot of people. Let's ransom them. I guess that's one way you can pay for mercenaries. <laughs> ransom people. Freed. Back to positive war score. Alright, now we're at 40% war score. Good. Nope. Let's go kick that army's ass. See if we can't capture any more fools and ransom them. He doesn't have enough money. 52 gold. We'll just hold on to him then. send my big army up to here. Just keep on taking shit from, from the Holy Roman Empire. And the year save. Nice. Oops. Ransom. There we go. All right, that army's dead. Let's head to Innsbruck. Wow, they got their independence. Awestrike. As long as these other wars keep going on, we're pretty definite to get our independence here, which is awesome. No, do not kill my son.
Go away, stupid ambition. <laughs> Hey, my dear Duchess, I wanted to thank you for your virtuous rule. You're an inspiration to me. Cool. Nope, still doesn't want peace. Cool. Yeah, you can't run now, bitch. You want peace yet? Nope. We're going to stand this army down. We don't need it. It's just too expensive. 20 gold a month. They did well for us, though. Let's go take care of these guys. Okay. Still no luck converting the people here. Damn. And they're sieging. That's cute. They're running to Verona. Alright, we'll head to Verona a bit. First, I gotta beat this siege down. Or stop the sieges, I mean. Seventy eight percent. No, really? Am I going to have to get to a hundred fucking percent? Norway is just doing a number on the Holy Roman Empire. That is amazing. Too bad it's not for independence. All they're doing is trying to get Norway or Norwegian ruler on the throne. Two percent. No. I really hope Poland can pull this out. Forty six percent.
Okay, now this is really weird. The whole Roman Empire is at war with Norway and Sweden at the same time, right? But Norway is also at war with Sweden. So it's a three-way war. Sweden's at war with the Holy Roman Empire. Sweden's at war with Norway. Norway's at war with the Holy Roman Empire. Norway's at war with Sweden. God, that's so weird. Ninety percent. Come on. No. Oh wait, 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 wait. Ah, our daughter needs a new husband. Someone who's not a homo. Prince of Nor. Yeah, but he's too young. Steward of Slovakia. Sure. Help me out, dude. Yes, Slovakia is going to help us. Now, hold on. That's a big army. And they're coming our way. So we need to get out of the fucking... Actually, can we get peace? Damn it. We're so close. 93%. You know what? Let's just run away. Now, go this way. Because we, we should be able to get to 100% pretty quickly here. Because the war score goes up automatically just for owning all of your own land. Oh, court chaplain. 19. Sure. Uh, go to convert Venice, please. Still Lollard. Yep. So he's coming with 7,000 guys, but he's probably just going to siege everything again, just like the last guy did. Which means he could very well... Oh man, 97%. So close. Now it's going to go back down to negative. Because he's going to start sieging everything. 98%. Ha <laughs> Uh, Duchy of Lombardy. No. Thank you, but no. Let's go get that shit back. Can't believe we got to 98% and then he arrived, you know? And he's still assaulting forts, so hopefully he'll hit one that's tough and he'll lose a lot of morale. Then we can attack him. It's already down to 4,600. That's good. Oh, he got peace with Poland. Damn it, Poland. Why'd you lose? Don't 
mind me. I'm just taking this shit back. You keep on doing whatever you're doing, Mr. Holy Roman Empire Army. And Slovakia sent troops to help us, all 128 of them. Thank you. Now might be a good time to raise all of our troops. And we should be enough to attack him at that point. Chaplain. 24? Oh my goodness. Convert these people, please. There we go. And now we can ransom that dude. And ransom that dude as well. Oh, we got three. And this should hopefully put us at 100% when we get this back. Some random kinswoman. Oh, she's our great-granddaughter. Wow, we've lived a long time. We have a great-granddaughter. Why do you not like me? Oh, because he's ambitious. Other than that, it's fine. Alright, let's get this shit back. Yay, prisoners.
Alright. Well. Hopefully this shit will be over soon. Because he's sending a decent number of... Yeah, he's just raising as many troops as he can now. This could be a big problem. If we don't get this shit quickly. Because we'll be at 100% if we get this stuff quickly. Oh, goodness. Uh, just... No. Get some claims. Last one to go. Should get it. And then that should be a hundred percent. There we go. One hundred percent. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Welcome to Independent Corinthia, my friends. Everybody stand down. Oh, man. That was so worth it. And now Croatia's got some internal stuff. The Zogbotted Zog Invasion of Italy. They're actually winning, so pretty soon Muslims are going to take over Italy. Well, hopefully they won't conquer us as well, but they might. Anyway, for now, I think I'm going to end the episode. It's been 3 hours and 15 minutes, this little recording session. So I hope you enjoyed our time together today. And please join me next time where we will continue in the land of Corinthia. This is Shenra from Shenplay signing off. Goodbye, everybody.